And let's get into the box a little bit more. Up in the top there, in the very corner, you have a shunt for the DC negative. This is connected to your batteries and to your inverter. Up here, connected to the shunt, is your negative bus bar. So all of your negative loads come in and go out through here. They don't get breakers. You never put a breaker on a negative load. You only put it where the energy is. Back here, behind these negatives coming in, is the grounding bus bar. It's bonded to the box and to the negative, and it will be bonded to the grounded electrode, which is basically a rod pounded into the ground. And that carries, the grounded electrode carries an energy that gets stuck in the ground system back to the earth itself through a ground rod. This conductor is actually going to take it to the ground rod, and Dan's going to have to get this in the box and land it in that grounded bus bar in this slot right here. The only one big enough to accept it. Let's take a look at these, the back of these breakers and how they're wired. So the first one we looked at before, the big one, protects your inverter, shuts down the power to your inverter. We have the batteries coming in this side. This is connecting the batteries to the charge controller. On the other side, this goes out to the inverter. So your batteries and your charge controller connect here, and then that power goes through the breaker. If you get a surge of power, too much power, it'll shut the breaker down and it won't blow up your inverter. In this charge controller, you have you can't see it here, but this side is the batteries and this side is the PV. Basically, it's input and output. The PV combined load comes in from the main. So let's go to that. This, this wire, PV positive, where is that going? It's going through here. It's coming back out and landing in here. Now this is an 80 amp breaker and it's connected to the grounding system so that if there's a problem the grounding system will trip but it's, this is the positive side it's a positive breaker um, and this will trip which trips this basically I guess um, so where is the other leg of that the O2 uh, this leg the output is going from the, to the battery um, to the charge controller and the other leg comes from PV positive which comes from the positive bus bar. This is the positive bus bar. But this yellow signifies that it's the yellow string, and this red signifies that it's the red string. And they're coming in to the DC positive bus bar, and then eventually a third string will come in here too, blue. Side from the panels from the combiner box. In the combiner box that we looked at before. Those those come in here, and then out of here comes this PV positive feed, which carries the energy from both of them. And then this charge controller output continues that with a protected circuit here, so that if there's a problem, this should trip and protect the charge controller. So now, the negative here, P 
PV negative is just coming off the negative bus bar. And like I said before, all your negative inloads land in here. They're all connected. So this is your PV negative. And this here is your negative output. This is from the charge controller to the batteries. So this will go into here, and the batteries will pick it up from the shunt. Where do they go? The, the battery shunt? No, the PV negative. The, the PV negative will go up in, into here. That's, I believe, yeah, this one. Sorry, not PV negative. This is out to the batteries. Out is, to the batteries, right. So it's not PV negative, it's battery negative. Right, but, they, but battery negative and PV negative both connect into the negative bus bar. Okay. And PV positive... Or sorry, battery positive just goes to the DC positive. Battery well. positive just goes to the. Oh, we already, we already. No, we didn't see. No, that we didn't see that yet. Battery positive does not go to the directly to the positive bus bar. Battery positive comes to the charge controller. Side of this breaker, on the charge controller breaker, and then out, directly out to the batteries. From the other leg of the. From the yeah. You don't want to connect the batteries directly to the positive bus bar and the negative bus bar, then they'll be bypassing the charge controller.